Hello everyone, welcome to Big Geek channel. In this video, I'm really excited to show you how a camera dolly can take your videography to very next level. This is the camera dolly and as you can see that it is compact in size, can easily go in any camera bag and uh, as well as very uh, lightweight to go with it. So, what do we have here is a screw mount that will uh, uh, take your camera over this you need to fix your camera directly if these two rivets like are uh, Intercepting to your camera if you want to keep larger cameras or DSLRs Then you can uh, place a photo tripod like this or a video uh, Video fluid head like such as this so that it won't interfere with these rivets and your camera can uh, be uh, on a taller side as well that means you can uh, uh, get a very nice view of the product that you are uh, trying to showcase uh, so as you can see that the camera dolly has got four wheels that's why it is called dolly have got this uh, thing to move to rotate and uh, pretty much move these wheels to any angles you want so the angles direction and indication is also given here in the marks uh, as a marquee and uh, you just have to loosen this and there you have it you can turn it the way you want so the more degrees you make it turn uh, the more it, the dolly turns very quickly so the lesser will be the rotation of this dolly and the lesser you turn it takes more movement to get you through the product so depending on uh, the type of uh, product you want to showcase depending on the type of work you can uh, take or you can uh, fix these uh, uh, four wheels the way you want. So as you can see that I've got a camera here fixed with a plate, base plate for my photo head over there. This is a video fluid head, this is a photo head. You can use this uh, standard tripod photo head uh, over this and make sure you have this little small, I think this is one, uh, this is half, half uh, uh, inch or one by four inch screw mount that you need to have uh, it does come with the camera dolly itself make sure you're not losing this um, this one this is really important for uh, uh, the universal mount of any of the equipments you want to mount on this uh, camera dolly so i'm going to mount my photo head over this just rotate like this and fix it on the camera dolly so before okay before that let me tighten this up Okay, now that the photo tripod head is fixed here, I'll take my camera and then mount the camera over this photo tripod head, just like this. So once you're done mounting, uh, let me just turn on the camera and show you how the video, tri video fluid head will look like from the camera dolly that I have set up right now. As you can see that it is really easy to set up and easy to get the shots the way you want to. So as you can see, our camera dolly equipment as well as our camera is uh, pretty much set for uh, taking a different video or say your photography. Now what I want to do is if, if I move this camera, as you can see that I'm already getting pretty much nice shots, but I'm not able to rotate it 360 degree very quickly. It takes larger movement, larger curve, longer curve for that. And what you can do is to just little bit loosen this and tilt the wheel of this camera dolly. And then you can see how quickly it moves uh, in shorter uh, rotation. Now you can see the product pretty nicely as you can see that I can pretty much move it all the way. Uh, make sure you are moving it very smoothly and fluidly. That's the key thing to have in order to get proper shots of this movement. This is how you get the panning or say tilting of in a very smoothful and very fluid manner. You can you, you should uh, uh, put a little bit of a weight on this plate and make sure you are moving it uh, with this l little finger taking support of uh, the base as you can see how closely how nicely i can uh, move and get my shots done 
So this is really good advantage of having a video, having a camera dolly like this in your camera bag. It really helps, uh, uh, helps your picture quality, helps improve the video quality of whatever the thing or whatever subject you are trying to take. I hope this video, small video was very helpful for you and that's um, about it. Please subscribe to my channel and like and share this video with your friends so that others may get to know about this uh, uh, little small equipment. I will leave a link in the description of this equipment if you want to buy it. It doesn't cost you much, less expensive and I think everyone can afford it to take the videos like this. So make sure you like this video. Thanks for watching. See you all in the next one.